I'm her child. Mom of a teenage girl. We're going to be talking today about moving out of state. Away Yay. from friends. Forever. We moved to Pennsylvania about three years ago. Two weeks before we moved and found out we were moving, because my husband's job transferred, we told Sarah, hey, guess what? We're moving to Pennsylvania. Call your friends for one last sleepover. You won't be seeing them again. I, well, that's not entirely true. I still see one of them. A grand total of one. But um, I remember running upstairs <laughs> and very angrily slamming my fingers against the keyboard to tell my best friend I was moving to Pennsylvania. And she got upset and I got upset. And it was the end of the world, let me tell you. The end of the world. Yes. <laughs> she decided to uh, not talk to us for a while. And be very angry for a long, long time. <laughs> yes, a long time. At the sleepover, we used like an entire can of whipped cream before it was all confiscated from me. Right out of my hands. <laughs> yes. I was very angry. I didn't even want to get in the U-Haul. No. I think I complained to Dad for half of the ride before I finally fell asleep. Probably. So we moved out here into a city. The city wasn't so great. The city sucked. The school sucked. Yeah, it was bad. Bottom line is moving sucks. And if you're going to be moving, and if your job transfers you, then I don't even know what to tell you because your kids are probably not going to speak to you and you're not going to be able to make them speak to you because they're going to be really mad at you and they will forever hold grudges. Forever. Forever. So, after living in the city for about a year and a half, we moved to a small town that was similar to the one that we used to live in. And I loved it. But then guess what? A year later, and do you know what they told me? We're moving. Again. And then everything went to hell. The end. <laughs> moved out of the school district. Life is horrible. And I'm still mad. I may be able to forgive you for moving out of state now. But I will never forgive you for this. I will forever hold a grudge. Okay. You'll call me up like 10 years. Sarah, can I borrow a dollar? No, remember that time you made me move? <laughs> <laughs> Sarah, you want to come over for dinner? No, remember, you made me move. <laughs> but Sarah, we're having fried chicken and chocolate milk. <laughs> but you made me move. <laughs> we can make it a milkshake. <laughs> <laughs> That'll get her. <laughs> Gets her every time. I'll take the food and leave. And I'm at the door, you know what I'll say? Remember that time you made me move? <laughs> <laughs> so, moving, whereas families have to do it. Kids will never like it. Don't move, your kids will hate you. <laughs> Follow us on Tumblr and on Twitter, Mom of a Teenage Girl. And Aggressive Zebra. <laughs>